everybody it's your girl Patty encourager welcome back to my channel i'm excited today guys because i'm getting ready to eat some of my favorite food on today guess what wanted to bring y'all in on it so if this is your first time on my channel i hope that you will join and connect with Patty encourager family guys hit the subscription button hit that bell notification become part of the family so here today guys i have a little chinese food that i had a taste for that my daughter had uh, got for me so i have of course i have an egg roll i had two but y'all y'all remember when y'all kids were younger you would ask them what they wanted Oh, I don't want none of that. Well, that's what my daughter did, my oldest daughter. But then as soon as she saw my extra egg roll that I had, oh, I want some of that. So, I had um, a shrimp egg roll and then a regular spring egg roll. So, I don't know which one this is it because uh, she ate one of them. But we going to eat anyway. And here's the little sauce that they always give you. The little sweetened um, egg roll sauce. Sometimes, guys, uh, when I have rice, like shrimp fried rice, I put some of this little egg roll sauce on it, uh, on my rice, because it gives it a good taste. But here is my food. I have some good old pepper steak. I made sure that they put plenty of onions and peppers on here. And um, it's covered, covering my uh, shrimp fried rice. Yeah, I know it's probably only a few shrimp on there anyway, but... <laughs> We gonna eat anyway, so what's going on out there? Everybody, what's happening with y'all today? I hope everybody is well and y'all enjoying this day. Listen, at first I was like, I need to throw on some clothes. I need to do this and that. I'm like, no, I don't. Cause I'm at home chilling and I'm with my family. So I have to do all that. Y'all know y'all with y'all family. You ain't gotta be doing all that extra stuff. So we just gonna get a little bite of this good i love all these onions and peppers they don't like me too much because i found out sometimes onions give me heartburn if anybody experienced that before put it down in the comments but i still love to eat them so it's good mm -hmm. and guys i have here some orange crush that I'm drinking on uh, today that I had left in the freezer a little bit long than I intended to because I had forgot about it actually. So it's a little frozen. So what's up y'all? What y'all doing? Some little pepper steak on there. Mmm. Drop the rice everywhere. This is so good. No one ain't gonna eat it all. I wanted to show y'all. Can y'all see the steak? I don't want it to drop everywhere because you know it's gonna drop. That steak look good. It look really good. Mmm, <laughs> look at that gravy. I hope I ain't get on my shirt. <laughs> no what's going on, y'all. It's so good. Them ass. Look, I'm trying to uh grip it here. These good old ends. Mm-hmm. Just for that crunch. Mm-hmm. This is actually my first meal of the day. Like literally. First thing that I've eaten today. Grab me a little green pepper here. Eat on it. Stir it real quick. My daughter had convinced me to watch that show, uh, Married at First Sight. I know many of y'all know the show that comes on. I think it's on Philo. If I'm not mistaken. So I had watched it last night i'm like wow so married at first sight so you basically marry someone that you really don't know 
you know anything about i guess you ask me the questions afterwards or however it go and boy i had a dream last night that i had met this man in my sleep and just like on the show i'm asking him what's his favorite food what he liked to do and people was clapping i'm like yeah i got my man now that was just funny to me i laughed so hard i called my daughter she laughed I was like, too funny. I got back into that egg roll. It probably didn't get soggy a little bit because I think my juice had like, I finally found the shrimp. I think the um, juice on here has spilled on it. This is good. Oh uh, yeah. So yeah. You watch me very, very first sight. No, I had that dream. That dream was really, really funny. Hmm, interesting show though. That's funny to me. That's after they go through all that and get to ask the questions and then they don't like something. You know similar things and it's like oh okay one lady say she don't like cleaning <laughs> it, was, it was a good show though but i just started watching it so if y'all haven't seen it check it out but if you have seen it you know put in the comments whether you like it or not y'all don't just eat look at that pepper steak it's really good. And it gives you a lot. I got this little egg roll here. Dropping crumb. I believe it's um vegetable. Because I believe she ate the shrimp for a little bit. I like this on my rice anyway, so I can pull it over here. Yeah. Okay, for vegetable. Look at it. No, I'm be good for probably very chicken nap. What's some um good movies that y'all watch? That might be on Netflix, Philo, Hulu, you know, set some stations, some new um shows that I can check out. But y'all, I just wanted to come and talk to y'all, see what y'all was doing today. And y'all, if y'all haven't checked out my latest video, can you go and um, check it out for me? I don't know if you guys get the notifications. Some people are getting them late, but I'm going to get a chance. Check your girl out. Mm -mm -mm. But... Be encouraged out there, everybody. Of course, I'm getting four. But <laughs> let's help one another. I wanted to share. Let's not make things bigger than what they really are. Sometimes we can blow things out of proportion. We can make problems, we can make situations bigger than what they really appear. Um, sometimes we can exalt things um, bigger than God, over God. And sometimes we have to sit back and we have to think about situations, storms, trials, as we call them. 
Well, we thought we weren't going to make it through that. Well, we thought, like, man, this is no way possible. But we came through it. We made it through it. And so I want to tell somebody that even in Romans 8 and 28, it said, all things are working together for the good of those who love God, who are the called according to his purpose. And if you are the called according to the purpose of God, then you know that whatever it is that you're going through, it's going to work out. It's going to work out for your good. You may limp, but uh, you may have to cry sometimes. You may even have some scars sometimes. Listen, guys, I have some scars <laughs> on my body. When I went through the season of, of sickness that I went through, when I had to have my kidney transplant, when I had to have the chemotherapy, um, when I had to have the dialysis. And, and so when it was over... I seen the marks on my body and one of them is on my arm guys and I don't believe that you even can be able to see it that far but there's like a a long cut like here uh to here and so you know when it was all over I'm like okay when y'all gonna take this tube out and fix my arm back they're like no we don't take it on I'm like what you mean so you think I supposed to walk around and the, and the Holy Spirit had to speak to me and say, honey, that is proof of your testimony. That is proof of where you came from, where I brought you from. That is proof of what I have done in your life. So you be the proof that the world needs to show them that God is real. And just know that all things is going to work together for your good. Y'all, this your girl, Pat the Encourager. I'm so glad that y'all came and y'all ate with me today. This good old Chinese food. All right. I love each and every one of you. I hope that you will enjoy this wonderful day. All right. Love you guys. Until next time.